Okay, before I get started on my blocks here, I'm gonna pre-select some pastels. And what I'm after is three values in each hue, light, middle, and dark value in each of the hues, in, in red, in yellow, and in blue. So I'm gonna start with the red because that feels like it's the easiest place for me to start. I've, I've got a couple sticks in mind here. I'm gonna start with the, the dark. See what that does for me. And that feels like it's dark. And I'm going to take my little value scale, and I've got the holes, and is it dark? Well, it's somewhere in between here. You see that appears to be light, that appears to be dark. Definitely it's, it's darker than, than this one. So I'm in the right ballpark there, I think. It's very safe to say. So now I want a middle value. For red, so I'm going to pick this one. I don't know if that's light enough, but I do want a bright red. So if I got enough shift in value here, let's see. Let's see where this one's going to fall. It's definitely lighter than that. It's darker than that, definitely. But I, I think I'm going to live with it. So I think that's okay. Now I need a light value, so I'm going to have to go to a pink. It's something like that. And let's see where that's going to fall. Lighter than that. Darker, it's, some, it's actually somewhere in here. But I'm going to live with that. Okay, so now I'm going to work on the sticks for the blue box. And again, the dark value it feels like it's easiest. And I'm going to head to my blue spruce here. I'm not going to worry about getting these dirty. It's okay. The pastels are going to fall. And that, that definitely is dark. I don't even have to check. I know that. And then middle value for the blue. That's enough of a shift, I think. And now I need a lighter blue. Let me try this one. This is a little bit of a shift of different kind of blue, but that's okay. And I think that's going to be all right, those three. Probably have to add on to get my blocks. Now I'm going to move to yellow. And yellow is a little tricky because yellow, it's, you really can't get a dark in yellow without shifting the hue a bit. And I've decided that I see a lot of green in the photograph, in the yellow. So I'm going to shift instead of, you could cut, you could make a case for shifting green or shifting to brown a little bit. But I'm going to shift to green. So I'm going to start with this kind of yellow green for my dark For the yellow cube and then something like this for the middle and then a light bright yellow for the light so okay that's where i'm going to start with my cubes now i'm ready to go i want to remind you <laughs> we're working on color um, with these cubes if your drawing isn't exactly in perspective I spent a little bit of time trying to get mine pretty right because I'm the instructor <laughs> but um, even mine is not it's not perfect they're they're not perfect perfectly in perspective okay the first thing I'm going to do is on each of these blocks I'm going to put those three values in those shapes. So, so I'm gonna start with the red because that was the easiest for me. And it is the easiest for me in here. Okay. 
Okay, there's a light. Let me do the... I'm just going to get these in there, each one. Okay, now I'm going to pick something for the cast shadows on the um, ground plane. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to put, there's a little cast shadow right here. Actually come up so here. Right here. I can get that in with the stick that I've already got. It's pretty good. Okay, now I'm going to get the cast shadow on the ground plane, and I'm going to use a purple for that because I want it to be um, pretty airy and light. And I'm just going to pick this real quick and get these in here. All right, now I want some background, and I'm going to use a light a light blue and maybe I'm going to add a pink in there too. Very light in value. As I'm doing this I can restate the drawing just a bit if I want. I can soften this edge of this, these cast shadows. I can clean up the, the drawing a little bit here. Okay. Let me add some of this pink in here.
If you really had fun doing these blocks, a good exercise would be to try these in open shade and bright sunlight.